Harvesting sand here. I want to show you what's going on here. There are some young men here who showed up today at my work. They get crazy sand. I want to show you how. Murantaka ni wanyesha vanya muna toa mchanga mra. I hope amuta wana vibaya. Ah yeah. I want to show you how they're harvesting sand. Young African men. Strong. Powerful. Look at these guys here. Yeah. We want to bring some girls for this man. Nasema ni wale tewa. They are laughing. They are saying, they are saying I bring them. Look. Ah. My friend, money. This is Maro here in my construction, guys. You know? <laughs> what's up guys welcome back to my youtube channel once again dash lifestyle youtube channel so guys uh, if you're new to the channel please remember to subscribe like share and also comment uh, today it is a beautiful day uh, for the my returning to my returning subscriber please thank you so much for coming back and watching my video thank you so much and uh, to the new ones please confirm if you have subscribed to my channel or not and if you haven't subscribed please click that uh, subscribe button so it is a beautiful day i'm coming live from africa kenya uh, today i'm in my home this is now my home where my mom uh, lives this is uh, my place and uh, where my mom lives so i just want to take you around and uh, after that i will be telling you what it is happening in the village uh, nyabuanzi village I'm coming with a more update from the village. So today uh, it is a bit a different video because I just want to show you my place where my mom lives. And uh, yes guys, let me show you so that uh, you can see. So right here we have uh, this project. This is now my project. Uh, um, I want to build here a, <coughs> a two bedroom house. But uh, you can see I have... Uh, uh, this is now my project. This is a two-bedroom house. So we have a two-bedroom house here with, together with the dining and this one it is the front We have our toilet there and uh, our land. This is now the Where our land reach you can see where we have our face the other side. It is a neighbors uh, farm and you can see he has uh, planted some this is the corn maize he has planted uh, corn and this is our toilet this is uh, my project i'm building here a two bedroom house but i have reached uh, this level so this is still uh, i'm still in the foundation level yes guys so i've leave it here because of the money but uh, soon when i get the money i will continue so this is now my project i'm building here a two bedroom house and you can see this is uh, where my mom lives. This is a house and you can see it is not yet uh, finished because I need to plaster it with uh, mud. Yes, I need to put here a mud so that uh, this uh, stone it can be covered. So let me take you around. <coughs> so guys, uh, this is now the clear view of uh, my mom place. You can see with the one the door which it is open that is where my mom lives and these are the neighbors so they have rented here in our home so they are our neighbors we have a small hotel here that it is playing music that's why i don't want uh, to go close so i think you have seen the clear view of uh, our home place and uh, you can see right here we have a uh, farm this is farm for our neighbor you can see he has uh, planted uh, these are called uh, bananas not bananas they i think i have forgotten the name of this uh, plant here in english uh, and uh, you can see he has uh, planted the cones and this is uh, our area our mom place Yes guys, we have the house for chicken, house for dog, and uh, 
this is the ballast which I'm planning to add more so that uh, I can finish the foundation level of this uh, project here. It is a two bedroom house guys and here we have our toilet. There is um <coughs> we have um taro here. Uh, I've forgotten the name in English. Yeah. We have a stream. There is a small stream passing here to allow water to go uh, outside when it, we have a heavy rain. So this is our home place, guys. So I just want you to... I wanted you to show you my home place so that uh, you can be familiar with it. So... Uh, here we have a, this is a house for chicken and this one it is a house for dog. Initially this house it was uh, here but uh, since when I started to build I remove it here and put it here. Yes guys so this is house for our dog I want to show you. <coughs> yes you can see this is our dog. Yes. We usually open it, uh, we release it uh, at night, yes, because uh, this dog it helps uh, in security purposes, so we open it uh, at night. Let me hear, it wants me to do it like this. I hope it won't bite me because it is very dangerous at night, but if it doesn't know you, it is very dangerous at night so this is our dog uh, we usually open it uh, at night to give uh, my mom security yes and uh, this is the house where my mom lives uh, this is our dog and uh, <coughs> this is a house for chick You can see. I think it fears. This is our house for chicken. You can see this is my mom where she put her chicken. But you can see it is a bit dirty, but uh, needs to be clean and uh, to cover that place. Yes. So the house for chicken, this one for dog, yes, and uh, this is now the main house where my mom lives, these are the neighbors, our neighbors, yes guys, so you can see this is now our place where we live, this is my beautiful project, so guys, uh, before going too far, uh, today we have some a new replacement in the village is guys marwa he has officially replaced mayugno as a top mason and uh, he has given that title to somebody else yes guys so i just want to see this video that it is coming uh, that's uh, to see uh, the villa meladin where it is uh, going and the work it is still on progress so before going too far i just want you to see this video and uh, i will be coming back and uh, telling you more what it is happening in the village so please guys watch this video then i will coming back and tell you what it is happening in the village yes guys look guys we are putting more tiles i want to take you upstairs to show you what's going on guys it's maro here uh, let me see i want to show you what's going on something here very quick uh, these are our tiles here we still have lots of them and they are fixing more and more look at that I want to take you up and see what's going on I have to jump because these tiles are new I think in the next one week we'll be finishing tiling in this house look at that guys look at that what a beautiful beautiful floor Wow, it's still dirty. They are working on it. But look at this. Wow. Wow. Thank you for supporting me, guys, every day on my YouTube channel. It's because of you that I'm able to show you this. Look at the sunset.
harvesting sand here. I want to show you what's going on here. There are some young men here who showed up today at my work. They get crazy sand. I want to show you how. Mbona nataka nionyeshe venye mnatoa mchanga mbona? Aupo amutaona vibaya. Aya, I want to show you how they harvesting sand. Young African men. Strong, powerful. Look at these guys here. Yeah. We want to bring some girls for this man. Nasema ni waletewa. They are laughing. They are saying, they are saying I bring the blue. Ah. My friend, money. This is Maro here in my construction, guys. You know? <laughs> so, guys, uh, I have uh, some more update from the village. And uh, right now, what it is happening in the village, you can see I am Maro. He's uh, continue putting some tiles I think uh, from uh, tomorrow he will be finishing putting some tiles and uh, there is another thing that it is happening in the village whereby Ayamaro he has uh, decided to replace Mayugno and uh, getting a new top muscle right now uh, Marwa he has a new top muscle uh, he's called Elid Elud is uh, our new top mason. Yeah, guys. So Ayamaro he has uh, decided to replace Mayugno because you know Mayugno right now he is busy building uh, his house and you know he cannot uh, build uh, two houses at the same time. So Ayamaro he has decided to give uh, Mayugno space so that uh, he can uh, go and finish uh, his project and that it is a good uh, move. Uh, yes guys, you cannot depend on someone who is uh, busy and your work it needs to go on. <coughs> we have a bad year but it has already gone away. So that it is happening in the village, uh, Marwa he has uh, decided to replace by Yugno. So you guys, uh, if you want to support Elliot, you can go uh, to his YouTube channel and uh, you support him. If you have watched uh, the previous video for Ayamara, I hope you can understand and you can uh, say in the comment section if uh, it is the truth and uh, yes guys, it is the truth that Ayamara he has uh, replaced Mayugno. And uh, Mayugno right now is focusing on his projects. You know right now Mayugno is building two, is building a two house at the same time, so you can imagine Yes, guys, he's building uh, two houses at the same time. So that's why Mayugno is very busy with his project. And uh, Marwa, he has uh, already decided to replace him. So guys, uh, today at least we have a sun. The sun, it is out. But uh, uh, this weather, uh, in, the, in the afternoon, uh, I think we'll have uh, rain because... Uh, yeah, we have been experiencing rain uh, for the last one week. So I think even today, afternoon, we will have a rain. So, so I have decided to come and do this video early in the morning so that uh, in the afternoon when it is raining, uh, you could be able to see this video up on YouTube. So guys, uh, here's, uh, remember I'm in Africa, Kenya, and... Uh, if you are joining, please confirm if you have subscribed to my channel. I'm giving you more updates from the village and uh, where I am living. Yes, guys. So, uh, and remember, guys, I'm not doing a reaction video. Uh, and, uh, yes, guys, I love everybody. And, uh, I'm not uh, preaching uh, bad uh, news to, the, to you guys. What I'm preaching, it is a good news, a good vibe. And I'm giving you the best... Uh, uh, the best uh, coming from the the best uh, news which it is coming from Nyabohansi village yes guys so for me I'm targeting uh, 5,000 subscriber so please guys support me by subscribing to my channel so that I can reach 5,000 subscriber yes guys another thing which it is in the which it is happening in the village you know uh, we lost a uh, uh, grandpa that is Sokoro Ayamaro grandpa uh, Yes, guys, uh, he's no more. So, once again, uh, rest in peace and uh, uh, 
to the family of Ayamarwa, I'm saying sorry and may God be with you in this uh, tough journey. So we were officially waiting for the we were officially waiting for the official statement uh, for the family of uh, Marwa and even Marwa said uh, he is waiting for for the official uh, statement. So after when official statement it uh, it comes, uh, I will come back and uh, tell you guys. Yes, guys. <coughs> and you can see right now, even David Junior, he's not happy uh, because you know they had a strong bond with the grandpa. Uh, yes, guys. So it is a very sad moment uh, in the village, but uh, yes guys, it is what it is and it is uh, the God, God uh, is the giver and is the taker. So yes guys, so um, I just want to go the other side so that I can show you more and uh, telling you more about uh, what it is happening in the village so guys uh, please stick around just want to show you around and i'm uh, telling you more about uh, what it is happening in the village so guys yeah welcome once again and uh, i have i hope you have seen the video whereby ayamaro he is uh, showing you how uh, he is harvesting uh, sand you have seen those um, there's some um, three boys harvesting sand in, on in the river where that river it has passes uh, to Ayamarwa land and there is some boys who show up early in the morning in, in Ayamarwa's uh, construction site and uh, he, has he has decided to give them a job and their job it is to harvest the sand from the river. So guys, uh, I hope now you have seen uh, Ayamarwa is uh, even uh, creating more employment and uh, is employing so many uh, so many uh, so many boys in the village is yes, guys so today we have a uh, uh, there's a uh, sun sun today we are the sun it is very hot guys the sun it is very hot and uh, this uh, shows you that uh, we will we'll have a rain uh, afternoon we'll have a rain I've just uh, come to this uh, shed here so I don't know why there is someone who clapping hand I think there is a family, they have come to sit here, let me show you, so that uh, you can see. There is a family there, uh, clapping their hand, you have seen this uh, family, here yeah, they are clapping, uh, they are playing, yes guys, you can see I am on this uh, field, yes, it is not my first time or second time to show you this field, so this is where sometimes i usually to come and uh, create some video because the area it is so quiet and it is a uh, chill we have a nice breeze yes guys so today update it was for mayugno and uh, you have seen mayugno he, he has officially been replaced by elim yeah elim now it is the now the top mason to marwa yes guys and there's some um, video that uh Paris, uh, you know Paris right now she's uh, Ayamaru PA, yes guys. So Paris, she's now Ayamaru PA, and there is a video whereby he was, she was uh, sharing a very sad story whereby they were they were with Marwa and uh, there is a dog that the Ayamaru dogs dog, yes guys. So he was afraid of Ayamaru dogs, and even she told Ayamaru that. Uh, the dog uh, she was uh, playing with the with the dog and the dog uh, bite him uh, in the leg yes guys so that it is the one side story uh, for Paris uh, she was playing with the dog and the dog uh, mistakenly bite him on the leg bite uh, bite uh, Paris on the leg so right now when she sees uh, Ayamaru dog uh, she is very afraid of the dog, but uh, you know Ayamarwa dog, it is very famous, yes guys. And there is someone who uh, who, who, tell, who told uh, Marwa to open a YouTube channel uh, for his dog, that it is Mbusi Amboka YouTube channel. Because that dog, it is becoming famous. What do you guys think? Ayamarwa should uh, open a YouTube channel uh, for his dog or what do you think guys? Uh, Yes, so there is someone who uh, 
told Ayamarua he should open a YouTube channel and that dog it will become the most uh, uh, view and the most subscribed dog on YouTube. Yes guys, the dog it will become very famous and it will be earning some a little money. Yes guys, so you can see the love uh, that the people love uh, to Ayamarua. You people you are showing uh, Marwa so much love and I love that guys. And uh, yes guys, let's support uh, Marwa. You know that guy, I love that guy because of one thing. He is very honest. Uh, Marwa is very honest and uh, he likes uh, truth. Yes guys, he likes truth and uh, he is very honest. That is the reason why I love uh, Marwa so much. And uh, you also, uh, you can bear with me. Ayamarwa, he doesn't like uh, corner cornering. <laughs> yes, guys, I know you understand me by saying uh, he doesn't like uh, corner cornering. So that is the one thing that uh, I love uh, Marwa. And also, uh, he promised that never to do uh, a free collab. But you guys, you can see Ayamarwa, he still has a heart to to help people. And right now he's doing a collab with like uh, everyone. Yes, guys, right now he's doing a collab even with the reactors. He's doing collab and uh, he's helping them to show them the way. Yes, guys, that it is the good thing about Ayamaro, and that's why you see Ayamaro is uh, winning more and more and more. Yes, guys, uh, if you are watching me for the, for the first time and you are com coming across this YouTube channel, please, my name is Dash Lifestyle. Subscribe to this YouTube channel. All, uh, all I'm doing in this YouTube, YouTube channel, I'm showing around uh, here in Africa and also my place. Remember, I'm in Eldoret, uh, was in Gishu. Uh, this place it is known for marathon. So this is uh, the place where I am. And uh, I promise you guys to give you more update from the village. I'm not uh, doing a reaction, reaction video. What I'm doing, guys, it is to give you more information about uh, the village. And uh, you know we have a big party here in Africa, so uh, what I'm doing, I'll be giving you the information about the party, and uh, the, also I'm going to update you what is going on in the village. So I'm not doing a reaction video, guys. What I'm doing is to give you updates and showing you around uh, the place I am here in Eldoret. Yes, guys. So. If you are coming across to this channel for the first time, please hit that subscribe button. I know most of you, 90, 98% you are watching this video without a subscribe. Please do the justice. Uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel so that uh, you can help me. That is the best thing that you can help a YouTuber by subscribing to YouTube channel. Yes, guys. And also remember to subscribe to the YouTube channel uh, for Ayamarwa. That is my big boost. So go and subscribe. Go and subscribe to Ayamarwa YouTube channel so that uh, you can be able to reach uh, half a million subscriber. That it is 500,000 subscriber. So that it is the aim. Right now uh, he has remained with like uh, 8,000 subscribers so that uh, you can reach uh, 500,000 subscribers. So guys, support my boss Ayamarwa so that I can reach 500,000 a subscriber you know if I am Marwa wins even us uh, who are following his uh, first step also we win so that's why I'm telling you guys to help I am Marwa reach a 500,000 uh, subscriber I'll be happy and also for me I'm going to 5,000 subscribers so guys are you please subscribe to my youtube channel and also subscribe to my boss youtube channel and uh, right now you can see the uh, Dimwango is uh, there is some rumors going around that Adimango he has uh, get a new boyfriend and uh, no guys he has not get a new boyfriend that it is uh, he is with a YouTuber who is called uh, he is called uh, Kish My World yes guys Kish My World remember uh, they are, they were doing some video with uh, Dimango and people they has they comment in the comment section people they were suggesting that uh, Kish My World he should uh, propose to Dimwango and uh, they will they became in a relationship or they become lovers but uh, you know it is someone choice you know yes guys 
but uh, even me I saw their videos their uh, Dimwango together with Kish My World they are nah, they are they have some good vibes yes guys they have some good vibes and uh, you never know what it is, what it will be happen but uh, their combination it is very good their energy I love their energy yes guys what about you guys do you love uh, Dimwango and uh, Kish My World for me I love them so much and I hope they will be coming together and uh, create some content together yes guys so that it is all the update from the village uh, you can see Marwa is very busy uh, with the villa and uh, the swimming pool after putting tiles and grease the next thing it is a uh, swimming pool the swimming pool it needs to be ready uh, but swimming pool imagine you can uh, you can build a swimming pool with uh, I think it is uh, three weeks Yes, guys, uh, you can build a swimming pool in three weeks, so that's why you can see Ayamara is not uh, worrying about the swimming pool because uh, he will build a swimming pool in, in uh, three weeks' time. <laughs> yes, guys, so the rain, it is raining a lot, especially here and even in the village. We are experiencing some more rains and uh, we are... Uh, I, we, are, we are waiting to, to we are waiting Ayamara to come and tell us about the kitchen, the outdoor kitchen, uh, where they have uh, decided to to construct it together with its meaty. You know, its meaty and Ayamara they were suggesting to put uh, an outdoor kitchen, but since the rain came and uh, they postponed their deal. So what we are waiting is to see uh, where they are agreeing so that uh, we can see the outdoor kitchen. Yes, guys. So there's some um, cow here. There's some, um, you can see. There's some, um, let me show you. There's some um, cow here. Yes, guys, remember I'm in Eldoret and I told you, uh, let me tell you that uh, the people who lives here, uh, the culture that lives here, they are called a Nandi, Nandi community. And you know this Nandi community, they usually have a lot of uh, cows, goats. They mostly depend on livestock. So you can find uh, one, uh, uh, one uh, guy, he has like a thousand cows. Yes, guys. Yes a thousand cows maybe a 500 goat yes guys that it is a uh, one person so this area uh, in our Sengishu a lot of the the community that it is lives here they're called Nandi yes and this Nandi they depend mostly in uh, uh, looking after they depend on uh, livestock yes guys so you can see there's someone who here uh, a mother looking after the goats <coughs> let him pass you can see uh, she is looking after the goat you can see yes <coughs> So guys, uh, that it is now the, I'm coming at the end of this video. Yes guys, if you are not my, if you have went to watch my previous video, go and watch my previous video. And uh, you will see me when I was in Yabohanzi. So even I'm planning to go there uh, very soon. And also you guys, uh, you should know that uh, if you want to be in a VIP, uh, VIP area, you need to pay at least uh, 100 uh, USD. That is uh, 10,000 uh, Kenya shillings. Yes, guys, if you want to be in uh, a Marwa party in a VIP list, uh, you need to pay at least a small amount. That it is uh, 10,000 shillings. And uh, Marwa, he has uh, already put the limit for VIP. So he only wants uh, uh, 200,000. Not 200,000, sorry, guys. He only needs uh, 2,000. Yeah, you thousand, two thousand of you, uh, you will be on a VIP list. So you guys, if you want to be in a VIP list, you should hurry, go and register and get your ticket. And uh, the others, uh, yes, I think the other it is uh, five hundred uh, Kenya shillings. It is a uh, three three dollar. 
uh, almost uh, 500 uh, Kenya shillings. So that it is now the entrance fee to a Marwa party. Uh, if you want to be on a VIP list, uh, you should book early. He only needs uh, 2,000 uh, VIP and the others, it is unlimited. So you guys, uh, you should, uh, I hope I've given you that information. So uh, you do what you, you want to do. If you want to be on a VIP list, if you want to be on a regular, that it is upon to you guys. So for me, uh, uh, that it is a bye bye for now. See you on my next video. Mm.